the brightness of this day has given me the opportunity to bring you this video welcome back to my channel winking it with ac my name is ac so um today is friday good friday and i was just about to prepare fried rice and i decided why not show you guys um do a quick tutorial on how to boil rice to make your fried rice so if you're watching this video and you've been using plain boiled rice to make your fried rice after you watch this video never again should you use plain rice to make your fried rice and yes it's very hot oh, it's sweating the whole day it's so hot anywho um so basically i got this recipe so i found this fried rice recipe from um samuel's kitchen on instagram so i discovered her recipe in january and i've been using this recipe ever since to boil the rice for fried rice and um, the fried rice recipe itself so this is for if you don't have stock to cook your rice when you're um, going to make fried rice and even if you have stock combine all of this together and it is so you're going to need oil butter I'm just going to I'm doing it on the go that's why I'm not showing you the things though but you're just going to need some oil some butter um, rosemary thyme um bay leaf curry powder some onions and some salt hair ingredients doesn't include onions but i figured if you make anguamo which is oil rice with onions and like the way it's so flavorful i decided to add onions to it so that's the difference i made with it so um let's get started with our rice for making fried rice Okay, so I'm pouring a little oil into the saucepan here and I'm going to go ahead and add the butter. In here we have our oil and our butter. Sorry, the video is dark, guys. Okay, so we have our oil and our butter in our pan. Now I'm going to add in, um, this is basically three bay leaves and then and then just a little rosemary and now our onion so I'm going to leave this to fry for a bit until the onions have um, caramelized and then we will add in our washed rice so our onions are done now so I'm going to go ahead and add in the rice so that the rice will fry okay guys so this is our rice I'm going to cover it and it's on very low heat i'm going to let it stew a bit in the oil and butter and all the spices for like two minutes before i add my water and my stock so our rice has been frying for like two minutes so let's go ahead and add our water to it so i'm cooking four cups of rice so i'm going to be adding three cups of water and then one cup of chicken stock I found chicken stock in the freezer so um, that's one cup of that usually when I'm cooking rice it's one is to one to so one cup of rice is one cup of um, water So in goes our thyme, just a few shakes of it. And then now we're going to add our curry powder. Salt to taste. And then we're just going to um, mix it all together and then cover it and let it cook on low heat until it is done. Uh, 
all right so our rice is all done now i don't know because of the light it's making it look washed washed out but it's actually quite um yellow because of the curry powder so i'm going to dish it out right so here is our fried rice well our rice for fried rice so there you have it that is how to cook rice flavorful rice to make fried rice with now the reason why i have it all spread out in the place is because i want it to cool down so the best advice you always get when it comes to making fried rice is to preferably cook it the day before and keep it in the fridge so like a day old rice but i never do that i always cook the rice just when i'm about to make the fried rice so once the rice is done i spread it out on plates so that it cools down really quick and then by the time i'm ready to add it to the vegetables it's perfect so i hope you give this a try add some more spice and flavor to your fried rice thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you in my next video bye sarah miss rushing who was rushing to come and say that bye Bruh. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next video. Bye.